An action-packed evening looms here on EA Sports. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski, ready to call the action. Should be a fun one tonight as we send it down to ice level. Ray, what are you looking forward to tonight? Why, well, always the team that's most aggressive. You get on the body, you create some turnovers. Once you create some turnovers, you're able to attack them. I think this game will be decided by who's up on their front foot more often. Opening face-off is just seconds away. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere. We're underway. Forces the turnover in the neutral zone. Puck sent over to Tara Vinen. Knocked around but keeps it going. Houston's gained possession along the boards. Coughs up the puck after that hit. From the point, looks to make something happen. He scores! They call him Seabass! Sebastian Ajo delivers! He's probably got about two seconds from the time that puck's delivered to find it. He can't see it, so he drops into the butterfly and hopes it hits him. Carolina's drawn first blood quickly here, Ray. Couldn't be much quicker than that, James. The very first shift of the game. A chance and a goal on the road. Ajo's one possession. Scored by number 20, Sebastian. Takes it to the net. Stones him in front. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Houston's got a hold of the puck. Slides it on over to Wang. The Cosmos played along the boards. Great defensive effort with the strip. Nice pass. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Taken by Chara. Carolina's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. Referee Gillivec calling holding here on this one. Yeah, he didn't hesitate either, James. No. It's like as soon as the player got close, it's like you could tell there was something going to happen. It's a holding call. Carolina's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. This is where your big boys get to really earn their money. Out on the power play for the very first time tonight. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. And a penalty coming up as the official blows the play dead. Tennessee is getting called for tripping on the play. I guess it's a little bit of bad luck, James. I mean, he's reaching for the puck. He's in position to try and keep the play moving, but he trips him up. The Hurricanes roll out their man advantage unit, and they've got lots of time with this five-on-three. With such a long five-on-three power play in front of them, they can afford to be patient. Don't take the first shot. Take the best shot. And they can't connect! In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Lots of time left in this period. 1-0 is where we sit at this point. Trocek's won the draw. Right up front! A chance! Denies him in front! Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close. He takes away any room. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Directs it on over to Trocek. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. And he comes up with it. Moves it to Niederreiter. Completely misses. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Officials blowing the play dead. We've got a penalty on the way here. A little too much stick and body hooking up on this one. Hence hooking on the call. Yeah, I, I didn't think this was a difficult call for the official to make at all. Big opportunity coming up with a five-on-three man advantage. Any five-on-three will tell you if it's successful. They're aggressive. They move the puck and they attack the net. They use their extra numbers around the crease, not out top. Gets it out of his own end. Carolina's got the puck behind the net. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. The Hurricanes take it along the wall. Shot tipped in front. Beautiful stick save to keep them from lighting the lamp. Howard's able to use all the 
the gear here. This is a stick save on the scoring chance. Carolina's had the shot advantages, and they also have the lead. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. And a successful clearing attempt. The Hurricanes gain possession along the wall. Morozik stopped the puck, and he's going to go for the whistle here. He hasn't had a lot to do this period, but he's been excellent and has been able to control the pace of play. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Carolina's ahead, 1-0. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Too much congestion in front. Nice zone entry from the middle. And he regains control of the puck. Oh, buries it for the goal. Guess they didn't need that power play. I guess not. They were really attacked the front of the net. They beat the goaltender, and now they'll lose the power play, but I guess it really doesn't matter. Take the goal. Quick shot on the first attempt, but that rebound came right back to him, and he's able to settle it and put it into the net before anyone else can stop him. Another chance here on the man advantage. Well, they've earned another power play, James. Of course, that starts with an offensive zone faceoff. They've had success earlier in the game. They'll want to double up on that now if they can. From right out of midair, he bats it down. Through center along the wing. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. Moves it quickly over to Bowmeister. Trying to get it out of danger. Call that a win for the penalty killers on that one. Yeah, he slams it off the glass. Now the power play's got to go back to get set up. Carolina's got a hold of it against the wall. Here's a short pass to Trocek. Takes the feed. Manages to hang on. Oh, what a block. He'll get a pat on the back from the coach when he gets off, if he can get off. He tips it. That's a beautiful pad save by the goalie there. Howard's always so secure in his save selection. Nice stop, but the rebound in the corner is the best part. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, the Hurricanes have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Nice job tying up his opponent. The Cosmos take it along the wall. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. Houston's penalty killers get their man out of the box. Nice save by the goaltender to get a pad on that. Carolina's capitalized on their offensive abilities here in this first period. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. A chance in front! Turns it away. Morazic's simply going to slow it down here, Ray. Do you like the strategy? I do, but he hasn't touched the puck much this period, James, so you get to handle it a little bit here and maybe a little nervous, so you jump on it and get to reset. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. The Cosmos ready to go on the attack. And that pass goes awry. The Hurricanes gain possession in their own end. Carolina's got it along the wall. Uses the force on that hit. Quick pass to Duclair. Tries to get it over to Fast. Fogel's got it across the line. Picked up along the boards by Vatnin. Houston's got the puck along the wall. The Cosmos have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Passes it over to Wang. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Gains the zone through the middle. And he takes a shot. Blocked in traffic. Here's a chance. And he makes the save. Vatnin's got it in the defensive end. Quick feed to Wang. Puck picked up by Kolchuk. Too many bodies in the way. 
A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Scooped up along the wall by Fogel. Morazic's going to elect for the face-off and maybe just a chance to play with the puck a little. Well, you get to feel it for sure, but he hasn't had much to do at all. His team's been in control as they lead this game. This shot comes from a real dangerous area on the ice, but the goalie's in position, and he makes a nice stick save. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Hurricanes lead this one to zip. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Houston's got the puck in the defensive end. The Cosmos are on the attack. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Grabbed along the board by Boyle. Brings the iron! The Cosmos have been pressing here, looking to get themselves into a tie game at the very least. That one won't help, and it's the post and stays out. Handles the puck. Great poise here as he gets it back. Carolina's got the puck in their own end. Moves it to Ajo. With possession along the wall. Stones him on the play. Picked up along the wall by McGinn. The Hurricanes looking against the half wall. Moves it quickly over to McGinn. Stop that one. Yeah, he gets out on top of the shooter. There's really nowhere for that puck to go. He says, let's get physical on that play. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Carolina's on the attack. Houston's got a hold of it along the wall. Pushes it across to Frolik. Keeps hold of the puck. Lets it fly and makes the save. And that goes off a player in front. Carolina's got the puck along the boards. Here they come up along the wing. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Houston's looking to break out. Here's a short pass to Wang. And now it's grabbed by Frolik. Puck grabbed by Athanasiu. Playing big in the moment there. The Hurricanes are in transition. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Frolink's taking it from his own end. Sends a pass over. Now a quick pass to Wang. Houston's got the puck along the wall. And that one's broken up. Carolina's in transition. Maintains possession. Shot! He scores! That's three, Ray! Yeah, just they haven't taken their foot off the gas pedal at all here. Once they got that first one, they kept pushing away. Now they've got three. Shooter's able to corral that saucer pass, and then he beats the goaltender. The Hurricanes are dominating in almost every facet of the game here in the first. Carolina's won the draw. Quick pass to Svechnikov. Unloads a shot! Denies him! He got all of it! And by number 88, Martin Nekis. Time of the goal, 13 minutes, 32 seconds. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. Carolina's been showing relentless pressure lately, now up by three. Houston's got it in their own zone. The Hurricanes have it against the wall. Oh, look like he had the corner, but he puts it off the side of the net. Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Great heads up play in the defensive zone. The Hurricanes have been by far the better team tonight. There's another intercepted pass, and they're just laying it to them. Scrum ensues along the boards. Taken along the wall by Hamilton. Quick feed to Svechnikov. Sends it in on the attack. Houston's gained possession along the boards. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. The Hurricanes gain control of the puck against the wall. Stays with it. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Puts it to the front of the net, denies them in close. Carolina's been the better team here in the late stages of this first period. More shots, more goals, simple as that. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Moves it to Fogel. 
slides the puck over. There's another stop. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. I want to go back to that chance we had just a moment ago. The goalie reads the play well, makes a great save on a really good scoring chance. The Hurricanes have controlled this game here in the first period. More shots, more goals. Carolina's won the draw. Puck scooped up by Shea. Oh, he'll feel that one. Feeds the puck to Perry. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. And he slides it quickly to Stahl. Fails to find the open man. Kovalchuk's got it along the wing. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Moves it quickly over to Stahl. And gets it deep inside the offensive zone, allowing them to get a breather. Slides it diagonally to Hoffman. Houston's got a hold of it against the wall. Tries to get it to Kovalchuk. Taken by Dezingle. Looking to make something happen at center. Fires it into the offensive zone. They fight for it along the boards. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Here's a short pass to McGinn. The singles working it around in the corner. Houston's got the puck along the wall. The Hurricanes go to work on offense. McGinn's going to play it to the corner. The Hurricanes grab possession to the puck. Houston's got it in their own zone. First period almost in the books here, nearing the final 60 seconds. Feeds the puck across to Niederreiter. Here's an offensive chance. Quick pass to Fleury. Stopped by the goaltender. Picked up along the boards by Niederreiter. Puts the puck on net. And that's stopped by the goaltender using his head this time. That was a big hit. You've got to be willing to put your own body on the line to make a hit like that. Carolina's taken advantage of their opportunities offensively so far here in this first. More shots, more goals. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Quick feed to Frolik. Pokes it away in his own end. We got a penalty coming up as he was hooked on the play. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. And the official signaling for hooking on the play. You gotta move your feet here. You're chasing the play. As soon as you stop your feet, you're gonna get called. Houston, Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. Well, there's the end of the first period of play. A blowout on the ice. But I'll tell you what, from this broadcast booth vantage point, I'm still having fun. I know Ferraro's still having a good time down at ice level as well. You want the assurance of knowing you have a ticket to all the big games? Then grab our season tickets. Guarantee your seat for the upcoming playoffs. Call the box office for more Both teams heading we'll down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. Opening face-off here in this second period is about set to go. Carolina's power play is still intact as this period is now underway, and they take possession. The Hurricanes gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Big stop by the keeper. Really sharp, never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Howard's a little bit fortunate there. He makes a terrific stop, but he just gets a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Carolina's been all over them here in this second period. Just look at the score, and they have dominated in the shot clock, too. Houston's got it in the defensive zone. Trying to get the puck out of harm's way, and manages to clear the zone. Carolina's going to play the puck from behind the cage. 
And now it's grabbed by DeSingle. Here he is in close. Gives them nothing in front. But he came out and challenged a good save. And manages to clear the zone. Slides it quickly to Ajo. Along the half wall with the puck. Receives the pass. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Takes a shot. Turns it aside. Beautiful stop. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. The Hurricanes have looked good offensively tonight, generating all sorts of opportunities. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Trying to get back on the attack now. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck along the boards. Dismiss that chance. I don't believe the coaches are going to be too worried about this. They didn't score on the power play, but I think it's most important that they didn't give anything up. They've got such a nice lead. The coaches are more focused on making sure this game plays out comfortably. Throws it in. The Cosmos scoop it up along the boards. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Nothing doing on that. Scooped up along the wall by Hoffman. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. The Hurricanes gain possession along the wall. Puck picked up by Trocek. Houston's looking to break out of their own end. Carries the puck up through center. Good use of the body on the play. Offside is the call that will have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. The Hurricanes continue to lead big here in this second period. Hull has won it. Puck grabbed by Duclair. Gaining steam inside the neutral zone. Smart defensive play there. Carolina's grabbed a hold of the puck. Manages to hang on. Chara stick handling in his own zone. And now he tries to get it across to Halla. The Cosmos moving ahead. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Puck sent in, and that will allow for a fresh group of forwards to get out on the ice. Hamannick's got it in the defensive end. Here's a chance. Oh, that just goes wide. Just misses the net, but really the... He scores! Now it's only a two-goal game. Also, it gets progressively better for them, but they need another one. they got to throw a quick back-to-back -back goal up here. He's tight to the net. He doesn't have much time, and that snapshot beats the goaltender from the low slot. The Cosmos seem to have shaken off that funk here, Ray. They had to get going a lot better than they had earlier in this contest, now down by two. Carolina's won the draw in the neutral zone. Strong defensive effort. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Moves it to Ajo. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Puck scooped up by Ajo. And that's broken up. Houston's got a hold of it along the wall. Dumps it in. The Hurricanes take over on possession. Through center. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Comes up with the stop. Houston's got the puck along the boards. And he gains the zone here. Houston's got it now. Heads to the back of the net. Tries to feed it over to Vatnin. Grabbed along the boards by McGinn. The Cosmos have it against the wall. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Oh, he flares up the arm with the blocker. Makes a pretty good save here. Carolina's message going into this one when we talked to them at the morning skate was to get a lot of pucks on net. They've done just that, and they lead as a result. Picked up along the wall by Pesci. Passes on over to DeSingle. And that pass is intercepted. Scores! A couple goals in right around a minute and 50 seconds. We are not done yet here. Buckle up. Don't even think about leaving your seat. Yeah, they got their track shoes on now. A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it.
The Cosmos haven't generated much, Ray, but they get one back here. Claw, claw, claw. They found a way to get back to within one, even though they haven't had many shots. Houston's won it. Cole Meester's carrying it ahead. Fires it into the offensive zone. Takes the pass. And now it's to DeSingle. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. And a strong effort on that play. With the steal. Sends the pass over. Here he is, shot right in front. Goaltender gave him nothing as it goes off the side of the net. Looks like there's a delayed penalty being called here by the officials. Whistle blows, stopping the play. I saw the hold, did you? Yeah, so did 18,000 other people, so it's no surprise the ref got it as well. Carolina's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. They've talked in the last week about really trying to be more aggressive on the power play. They were earlier on, and their coach has got to be pleased with the results so far. Carolina's gained possession along the boards. Across the line from center. Taken along the wall by Chara. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Now he slides it up to Chara. That's sent in deep, and the forwards will change. The Hurricanes gain control of the puck against the wall. Into the corner of the attacking area. The Cosmos have possession shorthanded. Puck slid down the ice. Looking to break out here on the power play. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Svechnikov's moving the puck through his own zone. On the attack along the boards. Loses his balance on the play. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Athanasius out of the box. Well, the only thing that happened on that power play was the clock rolled along. Very few chances, not much danger. Takes the feed. Moves it around along the half wall. Great heads up play by the defender. And it's a quick pass to Niederreiter. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. There's the whistle penalty coming up. Now uh, you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. Houston sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Well, good news for them as they trail by one, they get a power play. The key here, though, James, is to be confident without pressing. Just get the puck to the net, make the penalty killer stress. And now he moves it quickly to Perry. Houston's got a hold of it against the wall. Dumped into the cross side. Carolina's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. They get it out of the defensive end. Slides it to Kovalchuk. Houston's got the puck against the half wall. Blocked in front. Houston's got the puck along the wall. Here's a shot, and that one's stopped. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Carolina's got possession at center. Vatnin's the victim of a hook penalty coming up. Whistle blows the play dead. Goaltender can't even get out. Fogel's going off for hooking. It doesn't take very long to get on the wrong side of the play. You're a step behind. You've got to throw that guy down. You can't catch him. Maybe you can get away with a hook. Not here. Just tried to play catch up and got burned. Houston's got a five on three, but not a lot of time to work with. Well, maybe you can get one chance before the five on three runs out. He scores! Well, they've been hoping that the extra work they've done on the power play will help them capitalize. They do a nice job there. Lots of options for them on this power play. They've got a couple of guys that can take draws. They pick the one on his strong side, and he wins it. It's in the net. More than half the frame has been played here. We got a tie game. 
And play resumes as the puck is dropped. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Puck cleared from the defensive end. From their own end, try to kickstart this power play. Duclair has got the puck along the wing. Oh, a violent collision against the wall. No matter what you do, that's never going to feel good. Good hit to knock the puck loose. Right to the middle. Here he is, wristed on net. Glove save, and the puck moves on. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. From the left side, they gain the zone. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck under man. Couldn't connect, although not. And that's the hat trick! Listen to this place! And here come the hats. I love this tradition, although I will tell you, they collect the hats up. They used to give them to us, and you're like, what am I going to do? I'm not wearing somebody else's hat. <laughs> James, when they look at the film tomorrow, that's not going to look very good. That's a pretty bad error that led to that goal against. Houston's given themselves a one-goal lead and kind of surprising where they're at considering the way they played. It's like they've dragged the cinder block around with them for the first half of the game, yet they're in the, the lead now. Maybe they can ditch the block and get going. Carolina's across the blue line. Houston's got it behind the net. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. The Hurricanes scoop it up along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Boyle. Can't get it to go. Picked up along the boards by Gardner. Through the neutral zone, up along the wing. Turns the puck over. Great read defensively there. Nice pass. And he gives it over to Niederreiter. The turnover. Here they come. His reflexes on display tonight. The Hurricanes get a hold of the puck along the boards. Here they are on the attack. Great hand eye on the tip. Denies him again. Denies him. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. Here in the late goings of the period, Houston's been the better-looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one-goal lead. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. The Hurricanes have had their chances, but they still trail late in the second. Houston's got a hold of the puck. Chara's taking it from his own end. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Houston's ready to go on the attack. The Hurricanes look to start the transition game. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. The Hurricanes gain possession along the wall. Foss got the puck in his own zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. Sent in deep and the forwards will go to the bench. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Puck knocked loose after that hit. Here's a short pass to Fast. The Hurricanes played along the wing. Takes it in front. Jabs the puck away. Just a simple save by Howard. Bufflin's lugging the puck. Quick pass to Chara. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Knocks the puck loose. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Scooped up along the wall by Pesci. And now he moves it to DeSingle. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. And play finally comes to an end. Here's the officials. So often in a, in a shifty little play, the, you're trying to get to the puck, you get your stick in the wrong spot, he steps on your stick, and there's nothing you can do. The Hurricanes once again send out their power play unit. Even though this is a great chance to tie the game, you still have to remain a little bit patient. Don't panic with the puck. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Quick feed to the single. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And that's picked off. And they move the puck out of harm's way. 
The Hurricanes have it against the wall. Feeds it over to DeSingle. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. Hangs onto the puck. Scrum along the boards. Carolina's got a hold of it along the wall. And they manage to clear it. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Last minute of play. Strong use of the body. Houston's got the puck along the boards. Deep inside the defensive end, still trying to clear, and they get it down. Yeah, good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. They just clear it down the ice. Carolina's got the puck against the boards. Huge steal at his own end, and the puck leaves the zone. Carolina's power play had some chances, but they still are down a goal. Well, there are times you look for your power play, at the very least, to gain a little momentum. They needed a goal. Now they still trail by one back to even strength. That'll do it for period number two. Boy, if you like offense, this is a game made for you. Hey, fans, we have a car in the east lot with its lights on. FSV 4494. If you don't know your license plate, it's a blue sedan. Third period is just around the corner, so don't even think about putting that controller down. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. Well, let's see what this third period can offer at what has been a score fest thus far. Ray Ferraro is between the benches at ice level. Ray, we've got 40 minutes played so far. How have you viewed things? The Hurricanes don't really need to change much, James, here as you enter the third period. They've had the puck a lot. Now they've got to find a way to get that tying goal. And the goaltender gets to the bench for the extra attacker. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. Hoffman's called for tripping. He's off to the box. Reaching for the puck, trying to be in position. You're just a little bit away, and then you get nabbed for tripping. Yeah, it's always tough to use the I got stuck excuse, right? It never works. Carolina's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Most times when you get a power play, you're excited to get on the ice. Sometimes when you've been this bad in a game, you kind of drag yourself over the board. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Puck clears the zone. Niederreiter's got it against the boards. Houston's penalty killers get a hold of it. Clearing attempt. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, that's their job. Get it down the ice, get off the ice, get some new people out there. And that's broken up with a stick in front. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Carolina's gained possession along the boards. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Cuts to the paint. Off a stick. There's the whistle as the puck skips out of play. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Houston's got a one-goal lead here. They're up 4-3. Carolina's got it in the offensive zone. Moves it to Shea. Moves the puck. Solid check to slow him down. Puck moved back to the neutral zone. Gets it over to Niederreiter. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. With the stop. The Hurricanes come up empty-handed on the power play. Both sides back to even strength. The pressure points on the penalty kill have been letter perfect tonight. They've pushed at the right times. They've sagged back at the right times. Gotten the requisite saves when they need those two. Carolina's been the better team, but not necessarily boasting the better goaltender trailing early in the third. Houston's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Moves it quickly over to Halla. Couldn't complete the play. Let's it go. Oh, what a stop. Right on the doorstep. Taken by Tara Bynett. Houston's got a hold of it against the wall. Works it across to Halla. 
And they fail to go tape to tape. Takes the feed. Way too much congestion blocks that. Denied by the goaltender. That's a dangerous scoring chance, but the goaltender makes a great save as he's able to snuff it out. The setters will glide into the dot. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. They go on the attack from the left side. Takes a shot, blocked in traffic. Moves with the puck in the corner. Back at the point, they set it up. Here's a short pass to Stahl. And now it's grabbed by Vatnin. Houston's got a hold of the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Takes a couple of knocks and loses control. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Mrazic. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period, the Cosmos have just had a little more offense than their opponents tonight. They lead it 4-3. Puck picked up by Boyle. Houston's got him along the wall. Wilson's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. Let's see what the officials say. And tripping looks to be the call, Ray. Really a frustrating penalty to take because you're just fishing for the puck. You get your stick in the wrong spot, the guy goes down, and you're toast every time. The Cosmos send their man advantage unit out once more. Sometimes it's just your night, and the way that they've performed on the power play kind of feels like they're going to get another one. Carolina's playing it through the neutral zone. Regains possession at center. Tosses it to Stahl. Carolina's got the puck in the defensive end. Reads the pass perfectly and picks it off. There's the whistle. Offside is the call, stopping the play. Carolina's Achilles heel tonight has been finding offense as they trail here in the third. The Hurricanes win the faceoff. Houston's got possession here in the neutral zone. A chance, and that one's turned away. Carolina's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. They clear the zone. The Cosmos have it behind the net. Quick pass to Duclair. Moves it to the offensive zone. Puck grabbed by Slavin. Taken by Teravainen. They move the puck out of harm's way. Houston's got it from behind the net. Quick feed to Duclair. Pumps the puck away. Grabbed along the boards by Hamilton. The Cosmos power play has expired. Both teams now back at even strength. Well, if they were going to stay in the game, they had to kill that off. You cannot lose touch with the score here. Smart read by the defender to come up with it. Moves it to Broussard. Can't connect. Gains the zone through center. Moves it quickly over to Perry. Here he is from the slot. Glove save made by Morazic. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Still lots of time left in the period. Houston's clinging to this 4-3 lead. Trocek's won it off the faceoff. Houston's on the attack. Handles the puck. Carolina's on the attack. Centering pass, and that one's broken up. Great block there. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Howard's going to cover it up. He's been busy tonight, Ray. And been good. A lot of times you get busy and worn down. I think that's why you jump on it, freeze it in a close game. Man, the teams have been going at each other since the very beginning of this hockey game. Nobody is back down. The body contact level has stayed extremely high. Houston's got possession here in their own end. And now he angles it across to Hoffman. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. The Hurricanes take it along the wall. And that's turned aside by Howard.
the Hurricanes have had more chances offensively, but they have not been able to convert trailing here in this third. Nice job tying up his opponent. Scores! And quite the counterpunch! We're all evened up! Now that you've scored this tying goal, you'd like to follow it up with a shift or two. See if you can really change the momentum. The good thing he one-times his puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. The Hurricanes get a big-time effort here for a goal to even things up. It should have probably come sooner. They've had the run of the play here. All the underlying metrics tell us that this goal was about to happen. The Cosmos have it now. Puck scooped up by Perry. And he'll take it back here deep inside his own zone. Pumps it away to stay on the attack. Gets a hold of the puck here at his own end. Quick pass to Perry. Houston's got the puck at center. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Perry's in good position to create a scoring chance, but he bobbles the puck and the chance is gone. And there's the save. Takes the puck behind the net. Picked up along the wall by Boyle. And he regains control of the puck. Maintains possession. Here's a short pass to Perry. Morazic's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. We are all tied up in this one. Puck has dropped, and we are back underway. And now it's grabbed by Pesci. They've got the defense outnumbered and makes the save. Houston's got the puck along the wall. With some open space at center. Quick feed to Athanasiu. There's the whistle from the linesman calling an offside. The centermen glide into position. Carolina's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Tosses it on to Fogel. Here's a blast. Big time stop there. Taken along the wall by Stahl. Carolina's at the back end. And he moves it up to Fast. And that's broken up. Nice zone entry from the middle. With possession along the wall. Here's a blast. Overshot it. Sometimes the only place you have is up over the goalie's shoulder. Sometimes you airmail it. Here's a chance. Takes a shot. That's blocked. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Nice poke check. Referee signaling for a penalty. Looks like we got a hooking call coming up. Moves it to Athanasiu. They've got numbers. Takes a wrist shot. Big save. Trolink's looking to make something happen here in the corner. Throws it on goal. Huge stop by Morazic. Here he is in front. And another stop. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Here's the official call. The Hurricanes have been handed two minutes for hooking. Once he puts up his little token argument here, he's going to circle around a bit and try and regroup here as he goes to the penalty Were you button. a haggler? Always. You never think it's the right call. Time for the power play unit to get back to work. They've already scored on the power play tonight. They'll get another chance here. James, I don't think they have to change anything with the way they go about it. Morazic's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Hamilton's made this part of his game. He levels his opponent here. Past the halfway mark of this period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Houston's got it, and they're on the attack. Denies them in front. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. The Hurricanes take possession off the faceoff. Trying to get it out. And mission accomplished, Ray. Yeah, late in the game, it's defensive blue line, puck out. Offensive blue line, puck in. Nothing turned over at those two spots. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Wang's tendency is to shoot the puck. This time he overhandles it and loses it. 
Sends it quickly to Hoffman. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. Carolina's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. And the puck clears the zone. Houston's got it behind the net. The Hurricanes scoop it up along the boards. Houston's got the puck in their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Shot on net with the stop. Here in the late goings of the period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Stalls won the faceoff. And the man advantage unit comes up empty-handed. We keep things deadlocked with both teams back at even strength. Wow, that seems like a big miss, James. Critical moment in the game, and the power play laid flat for them. Musa quickly over to McGinn. And we got a delayed penalty coming up here. And the play is whistled dead. Let's see what the call is made. They've been trying to cut out the clutching and grabbing, and this is a pretty clear-cut case here. Yeah, I don't think you're going to get away with this very often unless you can shield the official from view, but holding call is the right one. The Hurricanes with another big opportunity on the power play. Well, I would say the power play has been nothing to write home about tonight, James, but now they've got a chance to score here on the power play, turn around what's been a real rough stretch for them. And that's wide of the net. Big time save on a big time shot. This is a face off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Takes possession of the puck off the draw. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Here's a chance. Houston's got a hold of it along the wall. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Sends a pass over. Made the stop on the play. Howard's got the puck, and he'll hang on for the whistle. Well, in a close game, you've got to be in control of things, and he's had an excellent night so far. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. The Hurricanes win it. Centered out in front. Stopped by the goaltender. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. The Hurricanes gain possession along the wall. Pass to Trocek. Cuts to the front. Stopped by the goaltender. Flashes the leather right in the slot on a difficult chance. Here in the late going of the frame, it's all tied up. Houston's got a hold of the puck. Battling for it along the boards. And the puck's booted away. Quick pass to Wang. Trying to clear the puck. And they do just that. Well, I thought they did a pretty good job there, James. That's a time you can get yourself running around in the zone. They didn't get there. Carolina's power play can take advantage. And you know what? A real blown opportunity to seize the momentum in this one. Uh, another good penalty kill for them, James. They've done the job start to finish when they've been shorthanded. This one, spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? The Cosmos gain control of the puck against the wall. Picked up along the boards by Hala. Play rolls on. Stones up with the blocker. If you're going to leave a rebound, it might as well be 30 feet away from the net. That's a really good stop because the puck's out of danger. Knocked away. And he gets a paddle on that one. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. Big play inside the defensive zone. Puck picked up by Granlin. He got all of that hit. Carolina's got the puck along the boards. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Morazic's able to handle that scoring chance like it's nothing. He makes a stick save on it. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. The Hurricanes win the draw. Carolina's got it in their own zone. Here's an odd man rush to his teammate. Stopped by the goaltender. Save made by the goalie. Scooped up along the wall by Perry. And now it's over to Wilson. Skates across the blue line. Right on the doorstep. Stopped by the goaltender. Howard's 
taking a look up at the big board on the replay. He'll see his stick save was excellent. That was a good scoring chance. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. There's the horn. Regulation time has expired, and we are off to overtime. Programs for tonight's game are available on the concourse. Featuring complete player listings for both teams, player bios, and informative stories. Overtime is just moments away. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski here in the broadcast booth. They are ready to drop the puck on OT. Sudden death overtime is underway. Right in front, and that one's broken up. Charas moving it ahead. Here's a short pass to Wang. The Hurricanes have it from their own end. Feeds it to Slavin and tries to make a diagonal pass to Ajo. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Stones him in front. A critical draw here. Offense his own face off and he wins the draw. There it is! OT winner! There's the final horn, and this one's in the books. They've got the lead in the series now as a result of a little OT magic. Certainly puts them in a great spot here. The series go by quickly in these overtime games. While they still mean the same as a regular time game, they feel like they carry a little more weight. Had a couple of these OT winners, yeah, didn't you? I got you? a couple in one series. They were fun, and they are awesome uh, to help your team win a series. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for hanging out with us in short playoff hockey. I love it.